everyone. Happy it's New a Year. New Year. Yes. Uh, I'm Miss Teresa. And I'm Miss Crystal. And we want to welcome you to church today. Guys, we are so excited that you're here. I'm so excited that it's 2024. Can you say 2024? You know what? If it's your first time with us, I know we normally have you put an emoji, but why don't you put 2024 Ooh, in the chat? That's a good one. 2024, because it's yes. 2024. Uh. Okay, and if you are returning guests, why don't you just give us a, let's say, a smiley face mm, because you're yes, happy. Yes, a smiley face. That's good. That's you're good. You're happy. Good. We're yes. in a new year. You see what I'm saying? So, guys, we're, we're so excited that you're here. It's a new month, so you know mm -hmm. we have a new theme. We have yes. a new virtue, a new memory verse, all new things. So, get ready for it. Our theme this month is. Pet Project! Pet Project! See it through. We're going to talk about that, mm -hmm. okay? So just stay tuned. Mm -hmm. And then our virtue is responsibility, showing you can be trusted with what is expected of you. Ooh, that's a real good mm -hmm. one. And that memory verse comes out of Luke 16, 10. Miss Cristal, tell them what it says. And it says, suppose you can be trusted with something very little. Then you can also be trusted with something very large. You know what? That just spoke volumes to me. If you can be trusted with something mm -hmm. very little, you can be trusted with something very large. So, guys, we're not going to belabor. We are going to go ahead and go to a special time of service yes. that we both love. Yes. And what is that called? Praise, Praise and, and worship. worship. Yes. Can you sing this song with me? We're going to say that Jesus is everything we need. So come on and clap. Hey, come on. Hey, hey, goes like this. Everything that I hear and see, everything that's good to me, all the things full of joy and love, everything below and above, up, down, in and out, all around. Jump up, jump up, turn around, shout aloud. It was you right from the start. You're faithful like a friend should be. It's your grace and love. Up, down, up, down, in and out, all around. Jump up, jump up, turn around. Shout out for things, everything. Everything. Let me hear you say E, 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 R, R, T, H, I, N, G. 
such a cute outfit. <laughs> what is your problem, bro? I'm sick and tired of people. I'm tired of people. It's people. It, listen, it's always people. People always mess with me. It's always <sighs> the other people. It has nothing to do with you. Absolutely not. Well, what's got you so worked up? Like, get, get, like Today what? Today someone... has been the worst day ever. First off, started out this morning. I'm on my way to work. Somebody going to cut me off. Can you believe that? Have the audacity to cut me off. I almost crashed my car. I could have died. What if someone in the car was having an emergency? You never I know. I don't care. Okay. Then I go to then I go to get my coffee. Go to get my coffee. The barista asked me what my name. I said my name is John. Okay. Very simple. J O H N. Next thing you know, I'm waiting for my coffee, but I keep hearing the barista say, "Don, Don, your coffee's ready. Don, your coffee's ready. Don, who is Don? Go to find out. She's talking about me the whole time. <laughs> Spell my name wrong. I'm sick of people. It's people just, stink. But I'm you still got your coffee, right? By the time I got it, it was cold oh because I didn't know she was calling me and telling me my coffee was ready. Oh, my gosh. Then I get to work. Then I get to work. And There's my boss more. is down my throat about something that I didn't even do. Can you believe that? On my case, about something I didn't even do. It was Jeremy. Jeremy's the one that's always messing up. I do my job well. Well, he. I'm sick of people. <laughs> I don't like them. But. I'm tired of them. You know what? You might be sick of people, but sorry to tell you, the Bible says something different. Oh, my God. Every time. I can prove it. Every time. Every Wait, time. one second. I can prove it. Let me, let me go to my Bible. Matthew 22, 37 and 38. You ready? Come look at this. Come, 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 come. Okay. Jesus replied, love the Lord your God Stop. with all... I can love God. Loving God is easy. Let me I finish. love you, God. Let me I love finish. you, Lord. Love Let you, Lord. me finish. <sighs> love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind. That's okay? easy. I love you, God. This is the yeah. first and greatest commandment. Uh huh. But right. verse thirty-nine. Oh, there's a but. And the second is like it: <gasps> love your neighbor as yourself. <sighs> Proof. That's all I gotta say. So you mean to tell me? I have to love the person that cut me off this morning? Yes. You mean to tell me I have to love <clears throat> Leslie the barista that got my name wrong? Yes. Mm -hmm. You mean to tell me I still have to love my boss and Jeremy, even though my boss is on my case for something that Jeremy did and I wasn't wrong at all? Yes, because God says to love others. So if we need to, if we have to love God with all of our hearts, with all of our soul, and with all of our mind, and then we have to love others like ourselves, if you love yourself, if you love God, you have to love others, even if they cut you off, <sighs> even if they get your name wrong, <sighs> even if they blame you for something you didn't do, even though you and Jeremy's name both start with a J, so maybe your boss got confused, but... You still got to love them. And you know what people who love people do? They pray. They pray for the people. They pray for their friends. You know what, Joya? I'm sorry. You're absolutely right. I know. If God says that I have to love people, then I know he knows what's best. Of course. And I would never want to represent him wrong. By having an attitude or being upset about some things, you know what? I think we should pray. I think so. Yeah, let's do it. Right hand up, left hand up. Heavenly Father, please forgive me for my attitude. Your word says for me to love you and to love other people. It didn't say only love them when they're nice to me, or when they're kind to me, or when I like the way they're driving, but you said to love people. And I know that means now love them regardless of how they may act. Because, God, you love me regardless of how I act. So help me to not forget that so that I can love my neighbor as I love myself. And so that I can represent you well whenever I go to work or to church or the grocery store or anywhere I go. I just want you to be pleased. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Guess now.
guess I got to go give Jeremy, my boss, a call and apologize, huh? Yeah. And I want some coffee, so I'm going to go talk to Leslie. Okay. Okay. Oh, you know, Ms. I got to walk her off Ms. now. Miss Crystal, listen to me, yes. girl. Oh, my goodness. What you think about that story? Well, it makes me think of the bottom line, which is love God and love others. That's right. Wow. God is love. Mm. So we got to love each other. Yes. I love it, guys. We hope that you enjoyed it as much as we did. It's our time to go, but we want to make sure to tell you to share, like, and subscribe. Tell all your friends about us, and we hope to see you next week. Yes. Bye. Bye.